it is Ipswich 1, Manchester United 1. Manchester United starting off for a point under the Ruben Amarin error and a way that Ruben himself did not want to start. A win is what he asked for. A win is what he demanded. And these players showed us exactly what we expected of them. They let us down. They let us down. Certain man to play up front with people said, oh, play him up front. He's got the pace. He'll be an excellent option for Ruben Amrin. Showed us he's not a striker. And I've always said it before. This guy, this scrub, is not a striker. And you know it is Marcus Trashford. And of course, his friend, his companion, the two, the three studios themselves, Conacho Rashford and Bruno Fernandes showed us exactly those front three. They suck. They truly suck. Suck so badly. It stinks. It pisses me off. It makes me furious. Ah, you know what? All we asked for is three points. United started off so well, so well indeed, with an early goal. But they let us down. Couldn't create as much chances. One on one opportunities. But I feel sorry for our manager. Do you know what? It's the first game. What can we say? He had to find out who the scrubs were. And now, Ruben, I hope you know who the scrubs are. I was telling you time ago, got friends that say, oh, hey, look, he starts Bruno and Rashford. I wonder why. Obviously, because they're the only good, they're the bunch, they're the best of the bunch of turds that we have. They are. They are. But apart from that, they're rubbish. You saw it in the whole night game. Missing. Bruno Fernandes, missing. Marcus Rashford, missing. Ganacho is the only one out of them two that was involved, but still made so many mistakes. Irritated you. Casemiro and Eriksen in midfield. Oh, my God. Yo, Eriksen and Casemiro especially, you got destroyed by Hutchinson. Hutchinson was having fun with Casemiro. In that first 45 minutes, no wonder why they equalized. I have to say, man, it's been one disappointing um, game throughout the week. The, 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 the waiting for Amarin to come in and then the lack of training session that you have with all the players. You expect that to happen. You expect that to be not the best, not get the results, to be honest with you. But today, in terms of the, the system, I saw managed that with a structure. And it was very hard for um, Ipswich to break Manchester United open. At times, they ran through our midfield, but not quite often. There's a plenty of work to be done for Ruben Amarin and his team. He'll eventually start picking the right players. But some players shine today. Maserari, you shine like hell, like a, a lighthouse. The whole game. Ahmed Diallo as well. And Andre Onana himself. Andre Onana, magnificent. He saved our ass so many times. He saved us. The mouth saves. It's just a shame he couldn't keep a clean sheet. I know he's furious and he's fuming. But overall today, I have to say that goal, the goal from Marcus Rashford, which was a brilliant goal. Ahmed Diallo showed us exactly why he's a baller. Man went through, ran through up there, found Rashford. Rashford finishes it off. But to concede that goal, that Hutchison goal that just touched the top of the head of Maserari to bend in and beat Andre Onano. It's a disappointing start for Manchester United. It could have been way better. But we'll take a point. Means that we're 12th in the league. We've jumped a, a position up, which is positive. But still, we're still on, on zero in goal difference. United need to do better. Player-wise, Rashford, you are horrible. You and your friend Bruno Fernandes are criminals. They're frauds. They've been fraud. Bruno Fernandez, Rashford, fraudulence, fraudulent activities. Call HM Revenue and Custom and report them. I've had enough of these two, man. I've had enough. Bernardo was garbage. Ericsson and Casemiro as a pair. I don't think it will work. I don't think it will. I mean, it was brilliant. Oh, now, now is my man of that match today. Don't give the match calls to that dick. Rashford and Bruno and, and Bernardo, the three stooges. But apart from that, you have to say there's a lot to work on. There's stuff to look forward to. We've got another game on Thursday to see improvements in training and etc. But big up to Amarin that's come in and, and set something. He said we will see something. We may not like it or we might like it. Still yet to judge or what I saw because um, players just showed me exactly what we've been seeing and, and nothing has changed. A big up to everyone as well, man. Make sure you guys tune in tomorrow.
for the catch up. It has been your your match reaction. Let me know who your man of the match is. Your donkey of the matches as well in the comments, and let me know what your thoughts. And tune in next week Thursday for the watch along for the Europa League. Till next time, remember to keep it united, and remember to keep it ready united. Your boy is out. <laughs>